Was your high school experience that classic Friday Night Lights Texas high school football experience? Oh, man, absolutely. I was fortunate enough to make the uh, varsity team as a sophomore as a running back, and we went to the semifinals and got beat by a team down there in South Texas. I think Port Isabel put it on our ass. And then we made it to regionals. We went to the playoffs each one of my years, but we couldn't quite make it to state. But God dang, man, the little town of Edna, 5,000 people, we would pack at that stadium every single Friday. It was a sellout no matter where, no matter where we went. And, you know, God dang, we played hard and we gave them hell. That's pretty awesome. North Texas, Dallas-Fort Worth, and North Texas in general has produced so many wrestling legends. The Undertaker and Shawn Michaels and Hacksaw Jim Duggan, amongst so many others. What do you think it is about North Texas that's kind of the hotbed? It's kind of like Western Pennsylvania for quarterbacks. North Texas creates the legendary wrestlers. Well, you know, you left out. Devon Erickson who's probably the most famous wrestling right. family out of Texas, and even over the, the entire, you know, genre of professional wrestling, Devon Erickson were superstars. I'll, I'll never forget when I was a, a junior and senior at North Texas State. We're 30 miles from Dallas, Texas, so I would ride down to the Sportatorium on Friday nights on the live show and Saturday mornings on the TV tapings, and me and my buddies would sit out there and drink beer and yell at the wrestlers and throw stuff at them and, <laughs> and give them hell and. God dang, man. We, they, <clears throat> Texas put out a, a lot of great pro wrestlers. I think the state of Minnesota did. Uh, so did uh, well, Canada or Calgary put out a lot of good ones. But Texas is right there in the thick of things.